Hello and welcome to my new video which we're talking about Dynamo. Today I will show you how to turn a topography subregion to a floor using Dynamo. So the tips is so simple is to make a shape edited floor follows the topography. To start off, we need to download and install the Clockwork package. The best is to download the latest version of Clockwork. By using Clockwork, we search for the node floor slab shape by points. So this package is a sample assembly of nodes and Python scripts. Like code blocks, Python nodes are a scripting interface within a visual programming environment. The Python node can be found under scripting in the library. So the next step is to create the node select model element to select the floor and the subregion in Revit. Dynamo need to have the topography points, so we call the node topography by points. The subregion can be created very quickly by tracing the floor boundary, but it must be the same boundary as the floor.
and regard. Now we have a shape edited floor that follows our topography perfectly. Graphically, it looks best if you relieve the subregion. If the subregion is deleted, then the floor will overlap more with the main topo surface.